Seems like no one is waiting for that same flight. I reached Bishkek this morning. Mm. The time between home and here changed like five hours and at home we are five hours back. That's why I I didn't really sleep. I arrived here at 5 40 in the morning mm. at the airport and I had no idea I wasn't prepared for coming here. You didn't really do any research, you get to the airport and it's super easy. There are a lot of taxis, they were kind of annoying. I was the only tourist I really saw at the airport and I, it's winter, I also haven't really seen tourists in the city. Um, so what happened was that like 20 taxi drivers were trying to get me into their taxi. Um, what I did, I, I know that from some other Russian-speaking countries, is Yandex Taxi. Yandex Taxi is the same as Uber. Um, <clears throat> just so I don't have to withdraw money immediately. And <clears throat> at Bishkek Airport, you will get Wi-Fi. Um, so you can, you can go for that. You just put your credit card number, same as in Uber and it takes you to the city. I also booked the hostel in the morning, the Apple hostel. I also booked it from the airport. It's like five euros a night. And they were super nice, super welcoming. What happened was that I got there, um, like 6.30 or so, I thought I, I, um, I can still go to the city and see something and then sleep in the evening. But it was, it was literally like not sleeping all night. Um, so what happened was that I fell asleep in the common area before I went to my room, slept for three hours, and then I came to the city center. Mm. Bishkek so far, it feels very nice. I went to burger place now just for simplicity. I haven't eaten in a while. Um, so, yeah. Seems like a very peaceful place, very quiet. Another popular um, way of transport. Seems like that's what the locals do. Um, is hitchhiking here uh, along the way from the airport to the hostel there were people everywhere standing and waiting and then people other people would just stop and would pick them up um, also there is what they call matrushkas it's uh, like a taxi that does the same thing there are kind of stops but they also stop randomly and pick people up so that's the other way of getting to the city that's probably much cheaper but for the yandex taxi i paid like seven euros something like that 500 500 some and yeah i liked that i didn't have to withdraw cash right away um, but could just like book it same as uber and go and yeah now it's already evening again i slept half of the day i walked a bit and I will soon go back to the hostel and sleep some more. Um, yeah, tomorrow I show you a bit more of the city and tomorrow I will also make a plan on how to continue.